Hey guys, this is Kevin again. The title of this video is called Philippines, the wife capital of the world. There are many places in this world where you can go find an excellent wife. But today I will make my case for the Philippines and share the reasons why. Before I get started, I wanna put out this disclaimer. Now, I am in no way saying that every woman in the Philippines is wife material, and not all Filipino women are the same. But I am using generalities in comparison to other women from personal experience. What would you guys consider some of the best traits of a good wife? I believe most men would say being beautiful, fit, feminine, friendly, cooperative, supportive, educated, and having a pleasant demeanor. In the Philippines, there is an abundance of women who fit those characteristics. <laughs> in fact, I have several single women right now in my own family who fit the criteria, which just completely blew my mind. So what am I saying? I'm just saying that when you visit the Philippines, you don't have to look very far to find women who fit the mold of a good wife. They are simply everywhere because of the culture and the way they are raised. Do you realize that there have been four Miss Universe pageant winners from the Philippines? Two in the last eight years? And the most recent Miss Universe just happens to be half Filipino. So beauty is in the blood. Most women in the Philippines have been groomed and taught from birth how to be a companion and a primary support to a man. Regardless of the man's financial status or social class, they usually remain faithful and are nurturers by custom. They are some of the most organized women you will ever meet. Uh, they have an innate ability to manage the household by mastering the arts of cooking, cleaning, organizing and maintaining an exceptional home. Also, they're usually the primary caretakers in the home when raising children. The majority of Filipino women all want children because they take pride in their culture for having children and it gives them a sense of fulfillment. If you look at the percentage of female college graduates here, the numbers are comparable to those of the US and other highly educated countries. Do you realize that here in the Philippines, most cashiers at the 7-Eleven and employees in the mall all have college degrees? So the next time you go walking in the mall in the Philippines, it's fair game. College educated women with traditional values everywhere. In the Philippines, English is taught from elementary through college. So if you're a man from the West, it is easy to communicate with them. They are cooperative in and out of the bedroom and can pretty much do everything you want from hanging from chandeliers to role playing, if that's your thing. Most Filipinos are quiet and reserved until you get to know them. And then that's when you'll discover their bubbly personalities. They have a pleasant demeanor and usually conduct themselves well in public. <laughs> okay, guys, now I'm talking about most Filipinos. I'm not talking about that one crazy Filipina that you ran into, which is the exception. So let's just be clear. And I have an extra bonus for you. Filipinas, they are hardworking. My wife voluntarily works from sunup to sundown merely because she's not happy until everything is organized, clean, and put in place. And that's every day. It's just in her, and that's just how she functions. And the crazy thing is, all of her sisters and her nieces are all the same way. Even though some Filipinas work jobs away from the home, they still manage to maintain their households and juggle their workloads without complaint. It is because of how they are raised within the culture, encompassing those traditional values. So guys, let me know what you think in the comment section. And until next time.